Hey guys, welcome to the final season of The Walking Dead. Surprisingly, it's only been over a year since the last episode of A New Frontier was released. That leaves me with a bit of mixed feelings as I'm, I'm always super excited for Telltale games when they come out, but The Walking Dead is a bit, a bit of a special game for me. It's my first Telltale game that I played and probably one of my favorite games of all time so uh, the first two seasons were absolutely amazing almost faultless games in my opinion but the series kind of fell away after that Michonne and season three were a little bit disappointing and Telltale games in general were a bit disappointing for a while so this is supposed to be their kind of return to form a chance at a bit of redemption and obviously as a fan, I'm a bit worried. I really hope they knock this one out of the park, but I guess the only way we'll find out is by playing it. So let's begin. Oh hey, it's AJ. <laughs> He's just playing with a gun. Cool. What you doing there, goofball? Pretending we got bullets. Well, don't. <laughs> it's getting on my nerves. I don't like goofball. Ah, oh, what? I'm too big for it. How about shit, but? <laughs> huh, so I guess you're all grown up now. Yep. Well, let me drive. <laughs> I'm not no. going to drive. Look at Claire more responsible now. What's wrong? AJ? Hungry. Magazine or a toy? Is that all? Um, well, I guess he wants to be an adult, so here, practice your reading. But I don't want to <laughs> take your mind off your stomach. Preheat oven. Place cream, vanilla be beans, into a saucepan and bring to a boy. Uh, on second thought, never mind. Yeah, maybe that so won't take his mind off food. <laughs> uh, oh, give him a snack. There we go. Here you go. About all we got. What about you? Go for it. We'll find something else soon. I believe you. She looks so dirty. Guess I haven't found showers or anything. <laughs> Alright, this place doesn't look that good. We gonna do it? Think so. Looks clear. It's a nice car though. We're doing it. Alright, so they've obviously done this before. Got a 
crowbar or oh, pry bar okay in case something gets in our way got a canteen of water we need water too yeah I haven't had clean water in days and we have a toy that we can pick up Whatever that is. <laughs> Even she doesn't know what that is. Alright. Graphics look really different. Find food. Alright. Let's find some food. I kinda like it so far. Friendly, ring the bell. What does it mean? It means the people here shoot first. Hmm. Should we ring the bell? Ooh. I mean, we could bring out some zombies, but maybe it would be good to bring them out first. Yeah, let's do it. What are you doing? At least then we'll know where they are. We've got one. All right. Well, can't say we didn't ring the bell. Use the mouse to look around. Cool. Jeez, so many noises. Yeah, we're probably gonna take that guy out. AJ, stay back. What? Ooh. Nice. It's down. Still with me? Still here. No bites. Next, we get in there. Shouldn't we look around first, though? Ah, cool. Can we loot? Nah. I like this. Whoever used to grow things here is long gone. Alright, so ringing the bell... There's probably no one here anyway. Can we look at the clothes? No. Monster trap? <laughs> it's not a trap. <laughs> he doesn't know what it is. For fun? You get in the Let's give it a go. Someone pushes you so that you go really high. I want to try. After we clear this place. Alright. Doesn't look super safe. But they never really were, were they? Tire swings. I mean, at worst, he'll probably fall like half a meter, so... Anything back here? Deer skull. Hmm, interesting. What's that for? You have collected deer skull, possible hood ornament. All right. That's pretty cool. food in the bin nope I like to look around at everything 
that I can before I do anything. Ah, drink water. Uh, do we want to drink bin juice? Probably not. Might get sick from that. Oh. Oh yeah, we got the crowbar. Shift and Q. What do we do inside a new place? We listen for monsters. After that? Uh come on, you remember. Breach and clear. Inside we a new place. We find a way out. Find, find a way, a way out. out. That's right. Just in case. AJ is always listening. What does that mean? I get it's good, I guess. Oh. Ah. Uh, they didn't make it. All tied up. They can't get us. That's sad. No, they can't. Hmm. Front door is the only way out. This one's locked. Security door. Hmm. Can't pry that open. I know you're hungry. I am too. We'll find something. I promise. Maybe we can find a key? Enter ticket booth. What is this? Uh, oh, it's a train station, of course. He has a key. Yeah. Uh. Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. All right. Poison. Poison. So they didn't wait the long way. Up. They wanted to leave this world together, holding hands in their own home. Will we have a home? We'll see. I don't know how I'm gonna be able to grab that without them grabbing me. We could try, I guess. Bah! <laughs> oh, really? Do we get the key? Mm, it's risky. Might be another way through that door. Let's look around. Let's be smart. All right, right, fine. Yeah, we'll see if we can find another way first. But if we can't, you bet I'm coming back to that. How you doing? It's hungry. Yeah, okay. Beans! Homemade. Be cool. More where this came from. <laughs> what is this? The Sims? Just put it in your pocket. Uh, anything they else? Well for their last meal. There's a water fountain. That doesn't work. Be that easy, would it? Yeah. <laughs> Anything else? We can't even go that way. So we need to get into there somehow. Well, for me. Can AJ fit in there? The window. Those are our options. It's dark in there. We should kill the monsters. 
They're not people. Well, they used to be people. And as people, they ask to be left alone. So what's best? Hmm. I don't really want to send AJ in there on his own. Because there's no way to get out of that without him crawling back through. So I'd rather just kill... Well, we only... We only really need to, like, chop his arm off. <laughs> I'll get the key. Or kill that one guy. I'm sorry. That. We didn't need to kill her, but... Come on. Oh, what? They make you use more than one hit to make you feel guilty. That's alright. That's the safest option. Like, if they were to escape by any... By, for any reason, then it would have been pretty, pretty ugly. There's no point taking any chances. <laughs> Alrighty. Huh. They had a good thing going here. Can we stay here? We'll see. It's got a no solid door. No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. Hmm. There's a lot of bad people, AJ. Be careful what you wish for. There must be good ones too. We're good. He found a bullet. Just a few. AJ's you know a great shot. You know this. <laughs> Save the last bullet for yourself. Always, Always aim for the head. That's yeah. right. Come on. I mean, there's not much Let's point shooting it. anywhere else. We can eat. Hope so. All right. Find food. I think that's past its use by date. Sorry, yeah. buddy. I'm <laughs> gone. Fuck. Hey. Hey, watch the swears. I meant shoot. That's right. Look. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> Something under here. Oh, cool. Floor door? Huh, yeah. I must have wanted to hide something. Ah. Jackpot. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. Oh, shit. Close it. It's rigged. Fuck. AJ. Oh man. Oh, that sucks. We gotta get out of here. Oh wait, until they leave. Nah, we're going. All right. I wanted to look around that place. Probably missed some stuff. So I looked at a bloody can. <laughs> you know what to do. Stick to the sides and be my eyes while I clear a path. Oh, he's just waiting for me.
Nice. Over here. Whoa. Good stuff. Let's get to the car. All right. Oh. Oh, with the key. Oh. <laughs> Can we just go? Please. Please the clutch. Oh my god! Now that guy... <laughs> oh man... Keys out of his face because oh, we released the clutch and we weren't even in the position to drive. Rookie mistake. AJ, buckle up. Oh. oh my god, get out of here! <laughs> Don't waste the bullet. Oh my god. Oh, that was a nice car too. It's probably fucked now. Oh, someone's helping us. Oi. I mean, I don't think these guys are bad people for killing those walkers, so... I'm not worried that they will steal AJ or anything. We'll see, I guess. Alright. I normally have to mute this kind of music so that the videos don't get copyrighted, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Sometimes I don't know where this dirty road is taking me. Sometimes I don't know the reason why. So I guess I'll keep gambling lots Seems like it's got most of the main people from the other seasons. That's the same music guy. He's pretty good, that guy. Jared. Love it. So far, the art style, like the graphic design, I feel like it's a lot better. I don't know, maybe that's just me? What do you guys think? I think it looks nicer. I think the audio is a little bit off, like um, when they're moving around the bushes and stuff. But it's pretty good. Clem looks really different. PJ. Why? Oh, okay. I thought it, was, it sounded like handcuffs. It's just sticky tape. Oh, 
What is this place? Indeed. Have a look around. BFFs. Alright, that doesn't really help much. I think we're in a walker free zone. Can she reach it? Nope. <laughs> so funny, she's playing like the part of the adult, but she's still a kid as well. Is there anything we can move? We got some books. Can't move that. Uh, first aid kit. We can move the chair. There we go. I don't know why this box is so important, but we'll see what's in there. This will do. Oh, we've got a weapon. All right. A pallet knife. That's for painting, is it? For spreading paint. All right, let's head out. Use a pallet knife? Can we not use it? I guess we have to. Because that, that red thing means that the choice has consequences, but there's no alternative, so... Into, we could go back in. Just a kid. I'll show myself. I'm not afraid of him. Put down the knife. Let you do the same. Ooh. We're not gonna hurt you. We got your boy, he's safe. I'll take you to see him. Alright. Your turn. See, we're not that's a nice bow. I'm Marlin, a little guy's Tennessee, ten for short. Tennessee, I've been taking care of you. Oh, cool. He, uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. We were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. You gotta take precautions, you know? Yeah. Just in case. No need to explain. Like you said, I was in pretty rough shape. Yeah, to say the least. It must have been tough out there. For the both of you. Anyway, I didn't mean to scare you. Just being cautious. Sorry if it came across the wrong way. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. Come on, let's go see your boy. All right.
Wow. So you've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah. We've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? I don't usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I can't imagine what that must have been like. Sure, I do what I can She's to get by. doing it for a while. No matter what. But don't worry about it. We all do what we have to. So, kids. Whoa. It's good we found you when we did. Slightly older kid. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Walkers were on the way. The car was a total. I already forgot that guy's name. Yeah. Fuck. Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. <laughs> I've seen some rough scenes. Uh, hi there. Okay. <laughs> sure. What's his problem? You're just new. I mean, we haven't seen anything like you in ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it's it like it a, school. Used to be a school. Yeah. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well, I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and a good location too. No one cool. really comes out this way anymore. We've carved ourselves the perfect camp. Kids are safe here. We make sure of it. Huh. Only kids. That actually sounds kind of awesome. <laughs> you think so? I mean, I like it myself, but I'm probably a little biased. It wasn't always like this, though. Uh, it used to be a lot of us, but... You know how it goes. Hmm. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy... Feels like you both fit that description. It's hard to survive too long these days without... You're pretty nosy. Troubled. Okay. I'm not gonna say anything. Guess I'm right. Especially about your boy, I'd wager. He's definitely trouble. It's been a little terror <laughs> since he arrived. All right. Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Shit. I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. But you got bigger fish. The kid's inside. I think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Get a move on, Willie! Music. Where's your damn weapon? Hello. Angsty teens. Alright. Alright, let's find Lewis. Follow the music. Check. Whoa. I hope that's not glass or china. That would pretty that would hurt. Is there anything we can look at in here? Flowers. Nice. Even if they're fake. What are we gonna do with that? We had like a deer skull. But we can't, we don't have a car to put it on anymore. <laughs> Whoa. Way. Hey, uh, that time you woke up, your little boy just bit me. Oh, shit. It's lucky I didn't take a boot to his head. Nearly took a chunk out of me. God, wow. It hurts him fierce. I'm so sorry. He acts out sometimes. He's been through a lot. Yeah, well, ain't we all? Don't see any of us sinking our teeth into either of you. Boy needs to learn some respect. You're probably like three years older than him, chill. I 
I wonder if that fountain works. Alright, there he is. I just want to have a look at this little place first. Hmm, can't go this way. Where is that music coming from? Ah, oh, okay. I think we could go upstairs as well, couldn't we? Maybe? No. Nope. nope. Music sounds like it's coming from this floor. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fine. I want to make sure I've seen everything, alright? Shush. I can hear you complaining already. Damn. That guy's good. Tickle him. I'm okay. And you know what you are? What? Ticklish. <laughs> but, AJ, listen to me. That girl out there says you bit her. Is that true? That's not cool, man. You can't be doing that, kiddo. These people helped us. I didn't mean to. She snuck up on me. Still, no more bites. No more bites. You're not dead. That's good. Hey. Watch your kid for you. My Who name are you? is AJ. Excuse me. I watched AJ for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. No problem. Well, not no problem. He was a bit of a handful. But I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't so that was Ruby. Behind him. Don't ever do it. <laughs> Loud and clear, Don't little do man. It. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. Damn, I wish I could play that good. Clementine. That well. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Oh, it's Lewis. That's no his worry, name. Duh. Hope they didn't steal our skull. Nice. Um, <laughs> double, um, does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude, that can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. <laughs> Is it actually loaded? Yes. Oh, good. He's earned my trust with it. He's a tot. Yeah, a tot who can shoot. You guys do your thing, I guess. It is kind of strange, I will you admit. Know any but... others? Well, there is one. But you're armed. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling Clementine. You are lost and gone forever. Don't you dare. Stop. Now. Dreadful sorry, Clementine. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. Loud is bad. Not always. Come press this key. Come on. This one right here. I gave it a try. Come on. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. Now press this one, and this one. <laughs> You're a natural. Hey, you seen Rosie? Nope. Shit. Got a bit of a situation out there. Um, <clears throat> to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. 
You up for taking out a few deadheads? Yeah, sure. You too, Lewis. Get your ass in gear. <sighs> Fine. What about AJ? It's gonna come too, I guess. Hey, Rosie! Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. Need our help to clear the way. Ah, so shit. A few more than usual these last couple days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Bye. What? Just saying. There's gotta be some explanation. Look, I didn't know any of that was gonna happen. Sorry if it caused you guys problems. Yeah. Uh, um. Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. <laughs> what he said. All right, boys and girls. They're starting to fill in. Come on. Be careful out there. It's going to take me a while to remember oh, all the names. Violet. She uh, grows on you. I promise. I like this guy. Oh, this? <laughs> it's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. Alright. Let's go. Nice. All right. Get that back up there. Laying around this area for these ass hats. They're all marked, so keep a lookout. All right. You're dead. Damn it. Nice. Is that all of them? One, two, three. Nice. That's a nice trap. Alright. I guess we need to like look around us. There's a lot of them. I, I feel like I'm, I'm hearing one behind me, but he's not there. Good stuff. Nice timing. We're not going to be able to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk when we're back inside the gates. Keep an eye out for stragglers. Have they met Clem yet? Circumstances and all. Thanks. Thanks. Let's finish these guys off. We don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school. All right. You're dead. <laughs> and the guy was just like, end me. 
Oh, watch it, dude. Quick! Woo! It's always cute. Oh my god. <laughs> Good boy. God damn. Girl, okay. Sorry, girl, sorry. Shit. Hey, see you That's and a Rosie big dog. Had a bad experience with the dog once. Well, so that's here, Rosie. She's <laughs> as cuddly as they come. Well, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. Ah, what a good girl. That walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right, fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking starving. You're not the only one. How'd it go out there? How do you think it went? Be nice, Asim. Safe stone's nearly dry. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk mm. about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. B minus then. Now, Clem here. That was a solid A. A plus even. Okay. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. Yeah, that's right. I know. You're both delusional. <laughs> <laughs> Such a chunky dog. They're pretty good with the monsters. Come on, y'all. Boots. <laughs> oh. AJ. Dude, chill. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> got him you good. Can't really walk up behind him. He's got a thing about that. Mm -hmm. Painful thing. <laughs> he can't go around punching people in the. I don't want to expect him to eat at the same table. I'll talk to him. Hey, <laughs> hey he did warn you about creeping what up on him. At? What's that bird doing? Well, that's gross. He should stop. That bird's a crow. In school, they told us they're called scavengers. Can you say that? Scavengers. No, scavengers. Scavengers. Okay. What's it mean? It means they don't hunt like us. They just eat stuff that's already dead. Huh. Scavengers are gross. Oh, yeah. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. AJ, I'm sure they'll forgive you, but we should go talk to them. Should probably apologize. But I don't think they like me. I can just tell. They don't. Hmm. If they don't, let's go show them how wrong they are. I think I'll stay here. Hey, come on. AJ, listen. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. So we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. Alright. Help AJ make friends. Ah, oh, man. Alright. No one around there. Who is this guy? Ah, oh, it's Ruby? There's that girl I bet. <laughs> yeah, you want to talk to her? You mean, say I'm sorry? Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta... Uh... 
played with a jerk. You just gotta <laughs> start with the joke. Once this is gonna lying, be terrible. Uh, okay. I already regret saying that. <laughs> yes. Knock knock. Who's there? Edge. Edge who? Bless you. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry I bit you. That was terrible. You're forgiven. You little weirdo. Mm. It worked. Alright. You sure did. Cool. Do we get to talk to Ruby as well? No. Oh wow. Hey guys. What is this? Our graveyard. You guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody really. This is where we buried ten sisters' belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them. Both about a year ago. Wow, that sucks. Paying respects. Should we do that too? Maybe? I've never seen anyone do that. I don't know. We don't really know mm -hmm. him. Let them have some space. Okay. I'm glad you're not in a graveyard. Cool. Violet and Ten. So this is good, I get to learn all the names. Marlin and friend. I'm not ready. Maybe. Okay. Ah, so we okay. gotta talk to all the others Let's first. Talk to someone else. Right. Who is this guy again? I see him. Hello. Hello. Oh hey, it's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Huh. Hmm, like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. That's Those cool. Who do not learn from the past and all that. You seemed really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt, which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. She... Hey, zip it! That is not yours to read, kid. Give it back. It was just sitting there. So? AJ, give it back to him. Okay. Thank you. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. I gotta preserve what I can, you know? I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be, like, rude, but, you know... Bye. <laughs> All right, so he's like the, the scribe. Yeah, I'm ready to talk to Marlin. Okay. Okay, let's go this way. <laughs> mm, yes. Hey guys. Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Eh, excuse me. Omar. The chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's not the chef. Yet. Omar's a perfectionist. The slightest flavor out of place and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. Alright, cool. Guess that's pretty lucky to have someone who can cook out of a, a group of children. Wait, we can talk to them again? Uh, uh, uh. Not yet. <laughs> you can't rush perfection. Come on, AJ. Let's go make friends. Okay. Okay. Can we talk to them again? <laughs> you know, staring at it won't make it cook faster. You lowering your standards might. You actually helping might do that too. Let's not get crazy here. I like that. All right.
Mitch and Willie. Hey. Who's who? Hey, you're new. That must be Mitch. I am. I'm carving a weapon. Uh, yeah, I can see that. You're good at that. You like that, huh, little dude? You want to see something cool? I want to see. <laughs> hey. Pretty rad, huh? That's how you fuck up some monsters. Oi. Swear. Uh, I'm sorry. Huh. <laughs> Where's that kid? <laughs> that kid's a doofus. I like it. Alright, I think that's everyone. Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a sweet little fella. Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweet. <laughs> Careful, he bites. Yeah, he is pretty sweet. Not everybody sees that. I won't pay them no mind if you won't. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? <laughs> Don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You, a regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Stew's done! Ah, oh, how convenient. You guys earn your supper after all. Does the dog get some too? It actually looks Pigs. really nice. Wow, I can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mm, this is really good. Jesus. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Eat slowly. Slow it up, AJ. You're gonna choke. Yeah. <laughs> Just because everything else died doesn't mean manners did. I'll say good night. Good night. She didn't need her food though. Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full. Uh. You can have the rest. You sure? You bet. I'm all done. Wow. Mm-hmm. Me too. But now it's still got steam coming out of tell it. You what? Time for something very important. Oh god. Good night. Violet, <laughs> it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only game hmm. there is. I don't know the game. The only card game I've played had less people. Don't worry. You'll pick it up as we go. Okay. It's easy. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner right. gets to ask Clem a question. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. And what if I win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. Ooh, wait, what about AJ? What about it? <laughs> Where'd he go? Looks like he's made a friend. Ah, cool. Come on. You can take your eyes off him for one card game. But you both could use a break from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Lewis, if you would. All right. Five. Oh man. Is it Jack? Way to go, me. So about AJ. 
This game doesn't really have any skill. Where are AJ's parents? <laughs> you two don't really look related, so... What happened there? They didn't make it. They're dead? They were nice people. For the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. For they the were nice part? people. Nice, that's a good card. Hey, I win. Hey, you do. So, what do you want to know? Uh, <laughs> Marlon's haircut. What's up with your haircut, Marlon? Oh boy. Uh, what do you mean? She means looks like a dead cat. <laughs> Probably smells like one too. Uh, I look cool. <laughs> Whatever you say. I say I look cool. All right then. Oh, that's a high card. Booyah! No. Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh, ever have a boyfriend? Oh what? Oh my god. What? It happened. Perfectly valid question. You can ask me <laughs> if I've ever had a girlfriend. I haven't. By the uh. Oh, I'm not sure really. Real surprised about that one. Never. Not even once. Never. Uh, I don't think I season win. three doesn't really count. So, Clem, you can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Family? Anyone? Lee. Lee was probably the only person that actually took care the of her. The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. What did he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? Uh, how to let go. Yeah, as Let's sad as it is. Die. That's pretty sad. I win again. You do indeed. Ask away. Uh, worst injury? That's weird. Okay, uh, what's the grossest thing you've ever eaten? It's pretty easy, uh, horse eyeballs. Slugs. Whoa. Cantaloupe. Come on. Dude, cantaloupe? I hate cantaloupe. I ate a guy's leg once. <laughs> I'm kidding. Are you? Are you? <laughs> It is plausible. Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. <clears throat> Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? Whoa, dude. That is fucked up. <laughs> oh, I know. That's a good political answer. Any one of you, but certainly not me. So sure. Made it this far. So have we. Yeah. I am the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. Ever? Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Well, yeah. Lewis. Hey, she wanted me to ask. Yeah. We. His name was Lee. I already mentioned Lee, though. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. <sighs> yeah, worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, it's probably for the best. Yeah, <laughs> that was a terrible game. Let's go, AJ. I wonder if they even had a conversation. Good night, AJ. Seems like they did. Long day, huh? Yep, real long. They have the same boots. Uh, I hope you Very similar, to anyway. On there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. Let's relax. Get some sleep. 
human for a night. If I did have to pick someone who would die first, I probably would say Lewis. We can talk about it. <laughs> so happy. All right. Well, that was the first night. I think now things will get a bit complicated. We've got to decide. Like they were short on food, they probably don't want to add two more people. It's getting close to winter. Got to work all that out. I guess they have a lot of space. Yep. Good. This box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like tin? Yeah, like tin. Huh. I like to do pictures too. <laughs> Shit, I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? Is it the box? Oh, what? That's what I was looking for. It belonged to Sophie. Uh, ten sister. He was uh. asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry, we didn't know. No, no, it's... It's fine, don't, don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's, it's fine. Is it? Is it fine? It's all right, mm. she says you can keep it. Ah, oh, what? Okay. Come on. Huh. I see you're, um, settling in. Yeah, is that okay? Sure, I guess. Mm. I always liked this room. Sophie had, like, paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. And Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice. Real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. Hmm. Oh, they sound like they were great friends. Yeah, Sophie was a good friend. And Minnie, uh, we were close. Me and her. What exactly happened to them? Sophie and Minerva. They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. So that's why they brought the safe zone in. Honestly, I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. And I'm not exactly like a people person. You know, I know I sure. sometimes have a habit. Have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. Yeah, me too. First impressions aren't exactly my strong suit either. Oh, right. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. <laughs> Not bad, kiddo. Wait, can I see? I should be getting back. Enjoy the art supplies, little man. Yeah. I think it's the right decision to let him keep see it. Yeah, see ya. There's, there's plenty to share with Ten. Okay, Alvin Jr. 
Time for bed. Okay. Here. Ugh. For me? For the wall. To make our home look nice. What's he gonna... good idea, AJ. <laughs> he tried really hard. All right. How about here? Cool. Me protecting something. Collectibles can be found in the world uh, to decorate your room. Ah, oh, cool. Nice. So we got the flowers and what? Hey there. What are you doing? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. What? Come on, AJ. The bed is way better. Oh, man. This bed is so comfy. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? <sighs> that door is really sturdy. Trust me. I tried to get out earlier today. It wasn't easy. Oh, I don't know. If I stay here, no one can find me. And I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. Come on, dude. AJ, listen to me. It's gonna be okay. Please just give the bed a chance. It's soft and warm. I think you'll really like it. Someone will come in and think that it's like child abuse or something. You're making him sleep on the floor. Hmm. This bed is really soft. Told you so. It's really, really soft. Good night, AJ. Clem? Hmm? This place is nice. I'm glad we found it. It is nice. Me too. Too nice. <laughs> You always get that kind of feeling with something just just too good to be true. We'll see what happens though. He's gonna let us stay, right? Well, so I should put subtitles on. I thought I had them on. Uh, subtitles on. I guess we're we gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Up here! Come on, Clem, this way! Hey, AJ, wait up! Tin's here! Oh, hey! Alright, you can play with Tin. Hi. Hey, Tennessee. What are you guys doing? I was looking for more pencils, but I wasn't able to find any. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. Cool. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These are the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen... too many questions, man. You'll meet one someday. They're still out there. Someday, maybe you'll meet one. That would be cool. Super cool. No, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay, that's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. What the hell? Come on, dude. It's mine. No, it's not. Ugh, fine. Thanks. Do you know where Marlon is? I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. So is this Ten's room? Or is this just like a, a lounge room? A rec room? Look! Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Louis. They're oh. so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? 
Oh. Hello? Nolan? Is it the dog? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, oh shit. I didn't realize I had to move. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Hey, 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 it's okay, Shh. We should probably become friends with that dog before it does something. I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were so scared of him. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. Sit, girl. See? She's Good girl. She just needs to get to know you is all. Yeah, we should do that as soon as possible. Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? Well, Rosie, shh. not really, Sorry. but... I promise she's not gonna bite. <sighs> okay, I guess. Get down on her level. Better get your scent. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. There you go. <laughs> now whistle and tell her to lie down. Lie down, Rosie. <laughs> That's so cool. See? Not so hard. Yeah. That's that a pretty obedient pretty dog. Pretty cool. Now Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. Hmm. She was the headmaster's dog, back when this place was still functional. But when the world went to shit, we bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow. Wow. Well, what a dick. True. Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like you Ironic, to... Ironic, he's probably you. dead. I'm part of that. Both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. Hmm. Greenhouse. So that's, that's the, the train, train station. station. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car. Pretty sure that place a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Hmm. Walkers flooded in there after all the noise you made. Fair enough. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. Uh, got a shack for storage right here. Right along the river. It's secure mostly. You get the occasional walker or two come by. Vine Brody should be heading out there in a bit. Okay. It's cool. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. That's probably smart. I didn't realize how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part, anyway. The greenhouse. Oh, yeah. Well, oh, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. Had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. We should now, look into that. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. That would be the best way to go. Surely. Pounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and Sam are set to go check them today. One more thing. See these red lights? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and food's become more scarce. So, why not go outside it? <laughs> we can't. Whenever someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if, if I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost so much. Friends, siblings, I can't let 
another kid die. We're not gonna let that happen. I promise. It's probably gonna happen. <sighs> Thanks, Clementine. But we'll try our best, damn it. I appreciate that. I really do. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis... I uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams could use some extra hands. Hmm. Uh, I might go with Violet. Look, we're, we're building a bit of a connection there. We're gonna go fishing. Okay. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, <laughs> as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. But as soon as we don't, go get him, AJ. You're out. All right, let's get going. All right. See you around. What are you gonna do? I really think the greenhouse is. I would have put that as a higher priority. You can make lots of food from that. And if it's like operational, you could probably grow stuff in the winter. You know, I've been thinking. I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, bye. <laughs> I've never driven in my life, but I'd love to learn. That sounds kind of nice. I love the open road. I wouldn't mind showing you around. Just as long as you're not the one driving. Yeah, fair point. No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. I wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. But still, it's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted. If gas wasn't Jeez, an issue, I don't know. Carburetor or flat tires or the train not the heart of the city, control. definitely not. Maybe the beach? I'd drive down to the coastline. Maybe park on the beach and go swimming. That'd be an absolute dream. You could spend every day in the sun. And die of skin cancer. Fun. We're all gonna huh. die. Wow. I'll take skin cancer over, turn it into a walker any day. AJ's probably never I've seen the beach. I've lived here my entire life. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. We got spears yeah. inside the shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Alright. Where are those spears? Hey. About by. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. They were really close with Vi, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, how do you even apologize for something that mm. fucked up? I don't know. Maybe I deserve it. It wasn't your fault. These things happen. Still, I was the one that had to break the news to her. And ever since I did, she's become... Distant. That's understandable, I guess. We all used to be friends. Guess I just kind of miss that. 
But when you showed up, I, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Hmm. Oh, the spears are right there. <laughs> Do you? I mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? See how she feels? About me? Um, it's just been eating me up inside. I could try. Sure thing, Brody. I can talk to her. Really? That's great. Thanks, Clementine. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. Hey! What the hell is taking you two so long? Alright, alright. I'll take this to Vi. There should be some extras lying around. I mean, we don't really need more than three. Find a spear. Maybe one for AJ? There's one right there, but I just want to have a little look. Go outside. Just some old gardening supplies. Could you use that? Hey you. I'm really Did big on the greenhouse. We should be using it. M. Violet and Minerva. What yeah. does that mean? They were good friends. <laughs> uh, it means they were really good friends. Like me and you are really good friends? Not mm. exactly. Okay. We'll leave that one. Wait, was there something on the floor? No. Cool. Good reach. Cool. Shut Ready up. to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> it just waits there. Can I join you? I feel like sure. that would be a lot harder than it looks. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess I don't realize it makes them easier targets. I wanna yeah. try. Take a spear. Go nuts. But don't break it. Go ahead and try. You're not running. Hey! Uh, something good enough for me. First shot. Hey, I'm sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> I understand. There are people I still miss too. It never really gets easier. Yeah. It really doesn't. Oh, what a champion! You hate her. Nice. Mm, gotcha. <laughs> Didn't look like I did. That's three for three. Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. She just said she didn't. Hey, nice. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is between. Well, I mean, we got at least five Brody. fish. That's not bad. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. 
Hmm. Because you blame her for what happened with the twins. Well, that's what I used to think. I just keep thinking that things might have ended differently if I was there. Maybe I could have protected Soph. And Minnie. She wants to talk about it, you know. I just... I feel guilty about the whole thing. Why? I was supposed to be out with the twins that day. I wanted to work in the greenhouse, so I asked Brody to cover for me. But then... So that's why they don't use the greenhouse? I, I wanted to talk to Brody, to tell her I didn't blame her for what happened, but every time I tried, I was reminded of who we lost. It was easier to just not talk about it. Mm. We should get going. You guys catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Lewis and Asim. See if they had any better luck. I thought we did all right. Canyon. What? That's where I'd go. If we took a road trip, start driving until we hit the Grand Canyon. Yeah. That would be cool. That would be cool. I'd like to go there one day as well. Thanks. Hey, you slow folks coming? Yeah, we're right behind you. Alrighty, we did good today. Yay. Where are those guys? Practicing making out with a toothless walker. Gross. I know. Poor walker. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Hmm. This isn't normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A Sam? Lewis! Spread out. See if we can find them. Watch out for monsters. Right. Huh. Empty. Cigarette? Huh. Is this a Bible page? Flim, found something. Someone's got a habit. I would say, if I had to guess, it would be a seam. Monster. Guys, over here! Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... What? Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. It's just a panic attack. Take a second. Breathe in deep. And hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Excuse me? I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. Okay. It's a bit harsh. I'll take this hall back to school. And maybe we can ration out something. So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlon kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? Let me think. Right. Um. The train station. It's out of the safe zone, though. Ah. We don't have any other choice. 
The train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but it's outside the safe zone. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. Hmm. Fine. Let's go. I don't like this. I hope I'm wrong, but I feel like this might not end well. And it's night time. Fantastic. There. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. How are they gonna get through all that? We barely got out of here. It was close. It sounds scary. There's a reason. Could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. No. We need to get in there somehow. Maybe there's another way in. I used the that bell? bell to attract a walker before. Could try it again. They do like to follow sound. You look mm. like you got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it, Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, wow. Hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. I think huh. you mean charming and theatrical. Okay, Prince Charming. Let's see those talents in action. I can't say no to a face like that. He's totally gonna die. Fine, I'll do it. I like him though. I hope he doesn't. Walker Lewis eats both of you first. I'll distract them until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! They'll probably push it over. It's already leaning. We might have to kill... One of them? Dude, can we kill it? We can. Nice. We'll just go around the outside. Jeez, that is not good. We could almost pick him off. Alright. He seems fairly safe there. Oh we shit. Not have a uh. Damn. I'll watch the door for walkers. Okay, AJ and I will sneak in, grab the food, and get out. Sounds good. Let's make it quick. If we could maybe kill a couple of them on the way, that would be really good. Is that guy alive? I guess not. He is! What? 
I knew it. Alright, well, we already killed them, so you don't need to worry about them. We haven't had to use it yet. Oh. Anything? Good job, AJ. Is there more? Nice. Keep it coming. Yeah. Is that more rice? Oh, I love me some rice. Yeah. I don't know what that is, but that's good too. Yeah. It looks empty. Oh, Stand. hello. Slowly. Ah, fuck. Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. I don't have Who to. are you? Who are you? The name's Abel. Abel. I'm hungry as hell. Alright. He was in the trailer. A lot of people thought he was from 400 days, but I guess not. Out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already, and organized some effort to get inside. So you probably also knew the stash was there. Just passing through. Decided to see what we could scavenge. Uh -huh. I'm not telling him anything. And you just got extra lucky. You look a little young to be out on your own. You got a group? Count you plus the two outside, I'm thinking maybe more. Hmm. You got a camp in these here woods? You ask too many questions. I don't like it. No. We can play it like that. If you want. Now I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. Well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Oh, no, that's impolite. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. It's not yours either, though. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my merry. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit mm. and I'm leaving. Like it never happened. We shouldn't shoot in here. You wouldn't let a hungry man starve now, would you? AJ, lower the gun. Clem, he's stealing our food. Alvin Jr., now! Hmm. Wise woman. Clem, we're running out of time. We need to get out of here. Don't panic. I was just leaving. Thanks for dinner. Who in the fuck was that? Just take a bag and fill it up. There's still plenty of food. Yeah, look at that. We got two whole bags of food. That's fine. 
Oh shit. Where's Lewis? There he is. At least they got out of there. That's good. I didn't... I kind of expected something to go wrong. Uh, Alright. I don't think shooting that guy would have ended things there, so... I thought I would take the safe option. You are not listening to me. Marlon, listen to me. I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Hmm... I mean, if he's seen, if he's seen the traps, he would know where they are, because it's not far. It's like right outside the door. Sam, Mitch, check it out. Food. That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Hey. Like seriously, it's a lot. Lewis and Violet helped too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither had you. Where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. She's seen him before? Did he follow you? No, I let him have some food and then we lost track of him in a swarm of walkers. You just let him take our food? What the fuck? Now he knows we're out here and he'll come back for more. She's seen him before. What the hell were you thinking? This is fucked. How could you be so stupid? If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the right call. Bullshit! What if there are others? You don't know what people are capable of out there. Think mm. again. I, I just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough. Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. Mm. You can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. Why? If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. Damn. Clem. I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. But. Shit. God. Nothing's easy. Sorry I went outside the safe zone. I didn't see any other option. There literally yeah, wasn't know. any other option. <laughs> I would have chosen that if I had the choice. Well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. Don't sweat it, Clem. Thanks, Ever Tim. since we lost Sophie and Minnie. Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll be alright eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna That's not a bad idea. Clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. 
dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but... You just haven't seen scared. enough of it. Being a walker is a lot worse than being dead. How do you know? Maybe being a walker is really nice. <laughs> I doubt yeah. Me too. But it's not like you can go ask one. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie hmm. was awesome at making stuff. She'd build a place big enough He's for a really all good of us drawer. And paint it too. And Minnie be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess death doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. That's nice. Someplace safe. And Unless you're a bad person. All of us together. Looks like a nice place to wind up. Yeah, I think so too. A lot That's better a good way of looking at it. Smelly old school. Who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Hmm. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes I draw this too. Can... can I be there? Sure. Hopefully not for a while. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. Yeah, you just sure. Gotta hold still. Sure, why not? We'll be the judge of that. Oh, I almost oh, yeah. forgot. <laughs> Here you go. Cool. It's yours. It's ours. He does have some talent. It's getting late. I kind of wish I could draw. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Well, draw well Are anyway. You coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. That's good. Making some friends. Got some food. I just need to get the greenhouse going and deal with that guy Abel and we're all good. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more no. minutes. Tell you what, you lay down and then we'll see. You full from dinner? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was. I like it here. I got to kill fish. Violet looked <laughs> like she was having a good time. It's nice not driving everywhere or running away. Yeah, I guess it would be. Nice too, before the blood. This isn't the ranch. The ranch? Do you like it? I like it. Now that I'm used to it. There's games and the walls make it feel safe. Yeah. I do. I really do. It's good to feel safe somewhere. Clem. Yeah? You let that mean man go at the station. You let him take food from us. It wasn't right. Hmm. I didn't like it. Don't be mad at me for saying that, though. No, say what you want to say, AJ. If we let people take from us, it makes us soft. Yeah, so I guess we'll find out how that huh? plays out. <laughs> Who's Mr. Softy now? <laughs> That's what I thought. There, you gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right, give me a minute. All right, now do we get to hang up stuff? Yeah! So used to lugging this everywhere. Never knowing when we'd find any supplies. 
I feel a lot lighter. All right. We can put something here. There. That's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture yeah. is good too. Oh, I know. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Uh, can we put anything else up? I thought we had more stuff though. Oh, here we go. There. You have to water flowers. Not, Not those these. ones. They're fake. So they never die? Never. Yep. Well, lucky flowers. But they're not as pretty. True. But they'll do. And where can we put the skull? I want to put the skull somewhere. Am I missing something? We can't see what we have in our inventory anymore. Let's talk to AJ. I'm not sleepy. <laughs> Liar. Huh. I'm sure we had something else. Unless we can only put that on the car, maybe. Whatever, let's go to sleep. Good night, sleep tight, don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time, bang. <laughs> Good work, and thanks. Someone's arguing. What's that? Shh. Look out the window. It's still night time. There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, no, no. Not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. It's that guy. You got your gun. Uh-huh. I'll be right back. It's kind of dangerous. Safe. Like any adult they find immediately outranks everyone in this place. Are you okay? You sound <laughs> mad. Don't worry. I'll find out what's going on. I know. Alright. Look at bed. <sighs> Not sleeping tonight. Did she sleep at all? Take the backpack, no. Alright, let's go. Alright. Follow the noise. Basement? 
doesn't really sound like that guy. This locks from both sides. Can't pick it. I have to find another way to the basement. A cellar door out in the yard. Okay. The cellar door. It shouldn't be too hard to find. Is that wind? Or rain? It sounds like rain, but it's wind. <laughs> According to the map, there should be another entrance to the basement around here. Alright. There it is. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Ah, oh, it's locked. Sounds like Bonnie. It's, uh... What's-her-face and Marlin. You have brick, heavy. Here we go. Oh, they would hear that. Jesus. It's not ominous at all. Brody, that's her name. And he got away. How do we know he didn't follow them? You know he's not alone. Those bastards are back, and it's only a matter of time before they find us. You know yeah. this shit. It's happened before. There you go again, getting so mad. What are you going to do? You're making me mad. Oh, we have to tell the others about what you did. Sam. Ooh, what did he do? Clem! What are you doing down here, in the dark? Brody and I were just talking. Go get some sleep. You deserve some shut-eye. You had a busy day. Didn't exactly sound like a polite conversation. What are you fighting about? It's really none of your business. Go back to the dorm. Hmm. The man you met at the station, we got history. Brody, don't listen to her, Clem. She's acting crazy. She gets this way sometimes. She's just got to tune it out. Don't be afraid, Brody. Say what you have to say. Jeez, he really what doesn't history? like that, does he? Marlin let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! Ten sisters. I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everybody. Oh shit. Cause Marlin was so ashamed of what Oh. Oh man. Uh, what'd you say? Did he just kill her? I'm sorry. Shit! What have you done? God damn it! Help! She said it. I told you not to say it. How? What can I do? Just, just stay with her. There's a first aid kit down here somewhere, right? First aid kit? Ah, oh, fuck. Brody, it's me, Clem. Just, just stay still. Uh, who? Uh, I, I, I can't see. Clementine, remember? We talked about going to the beach, swimming, driving along the coast. Son. Clem, you're in danger. Fucking hell. You and AJ both. What danger? Marlon will kill me if I tell. He's scared. And when he 
he's scared. He gets angry. Brody, if there's a threat to AJ, you have to tell me. Everything is so faint. I can't uh, feel my legs. She's not going to make try it. Try and focus. If those raiders come back. Marlon said he'd let him take you. Take us? To make him go away. Like he did. <laughs> Like he did with ten sisters. Oh, fuck. Brody. Oh, fuck. Jeez. Oh, no. Oh, no. What the hell am I gonna do? She's gonna turn. Yeah. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. I'm sorry. I can't let you talk to me about this. Are you serious? Yeah, but Brody's turning. Is just gonna be like, ah. Where did she go? Oh, I don't like this. Let's just go. What is that? Check upstairs door. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Must have the key. Damn it. Uh. No. Oh, wait, that's where we came. So we have to go. Towards her. She was like right there. Where'd she go? Ah. Okay, good. We got it. It works. Is that a, a ruler? Work. It is a ruler. Thin enough. All right. Oh, that a basketball? Oh, we can't even take it. We don't have a backpack. <laughs> More important things. Oh. oh, for fuck's sake. Hold. It won't? Why not? Go. Alright. Go, go, go. What? Go! Alright, good. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. So I gotta kill her again. Oh man. Oh the lights becoming red. Fuck me.
That's terrible. <sighs> God damn it. I wonder if he would have done that if we didn't provoke him. Put the gun down. Get this fucking psycho away from me. Where is she? she she's in the basement. She murdered Brody. What? Whoa. Is that blood on your face? Why Brody? Did you see it happen? Is she a walker now? Get the hell away from AJ, asshole! Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open. That's a lie! I saw you kill her! What the hell is going on? God damn it. She's covered in Brody's blood. Jesus Christ, Clem. What did you do? Oh. We saved their lives when anyone else would have kept walking. We fed them, we kept them warm, and this is how they thank us. Guns being pulled and murder. Well, fuck them. Wow. Jesus Christ. You shoot me. What do you offer up to your raider friends when they come knocking? What the hell is she talking about? Don't do it, because he needs us alive. Shut up! Brody told me Marlon was gonna give me and AJ up to raiders in exchange for safety. The same way he gave up Sophie and Minnie. Raiders? Oh my god. Shut the fuck up, Clementine! Let her talk! Brody told me the truth, and that's when Marlon killed her! Damn. Come the fuck on! They only met up with these raiders because Clem insisted they go out there. Quite the coincidence, isn't it? Shame, I don't believe in those. Think about how scared we all were when the adults left. I pulled us out of that fear. I gave us all courage again. Who are you all gonna believe, huh? Johnny come lately and her little fucking lunatic? Or me, your friend? Did help us get food. What good is food if a group of outsiders are going to Probably Violet. I'm just saying. Man, this is fucked up. Uh, it is young. really fucked up. You have to believe me. You don't. You met her like two days ago. I don't know you, Clem. Really? I'm sorry. Ooh. So you'll let Marlin shoot me? Seriously? I don't want to criticize don't let her. her. Get in your head. Hey, what did you want you to do? She was my friend too. So was Brody. Clem, I. <sighs> Shit. It will all feel safer. Once I pull this trigger. God damn it. You were there that day those raiders came? He would have abandoned you too. That's a good point. Yeah, come on. Violet being difficult. Why am I not surprised? Put down the gun now. We're gonna do this the right way. Stand down, Marlon. Be reasonable. He's going to shoot someone, isn't he? You don't get it. You, you don't understand at all. Do you? I'm trying to protect you! All of you! Every fucking one God damn you. it. How is pointing a loaded gun around protect anyone? Brody's dead. Sophie and Minerva are gone. You suck at protection. Hey. <laughs> I'm 
I made the right call. I saved the lives of everyone in this fucking school. I came back. I do it again. Excuse me? I didn't realize we were so fucking expendable. Your dick they told me they died. I had to save the rest of you, okay? You gave my sisters away. Why would you do something like that? I trusted you, Marlin. They trusted you. Hmm. We all trusted you. I know. I know. It might be good that I didn't say anything, actually. I wanted to get them. Stage some kind of rescue. Honest, Ted, I just couldn't. I was just too afraid. You killed Brody because she knew. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't want this. I wanted to save all of you. Let's so go for reconciliation. Minerva. I don't want this to get what? out of hand. We can still fix this, Marlin. It's going to be okay. We can make this right. We'll help you. We're all family here. The only one any of us has left. What's he gonna do? Nice. Good job. Maybe we could rescue them. Who knows? I know I betrayed you. All of you. Just let me leave. You'll never have to see me again. Just let me become a bad memory. Just give me that. You are our prisoner. Please. Fine. Whoa! What the fuck? Dude! What? I aimed for the head. Why did you do that? <sighs> God damn it, AJ! You gotta read the room! <sighs> wow, what a mess. Alright, let's go through these choices. You and 58% killed the walker couple in a train station. 42% let AJ go through the window. Wow, okay. So it's almost 50 50. 52% of players went fishing, and 48 went with Lewis. Okay. Okay. That's 50-50 as well. That's not a real significant choice, though. Convince AJ to sleep on the bed. <laughs> and 34 let him sleep on the floor. Great. Mmm. Don't know about this one. I guess maybe I don't know what he was doing with those children. Whether he, I know it sounds harsh, but he might have used those as food. So maybe the fact that we gave him food meant that he didn't come back yet. I don't know. We'll we'll see. Often the contentious decisions at the start end up being all right towards the end. So we'll, we'll, we'll wait and see on that one. Uh, turn to help Violet. Alright, turn to Violet for help, yeah. Well, I guess the players that went with Lewis would have turned to Lewis for help, so. Cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy with those choices. Marlin dead. It's relieved to be forgiven. Damn. I don't know if there's a way that we could have changed that. We might have. I'm interested to see if it's possible to keep him alive. 
She was pleased after you complimented her fighting skills. She was flattered after you comforted her in the dorm rooms. AJ is hardened. Comforted when you convinced him to sleep on the bed. Disappointed that you let Abel get away. If anything, I thought that might show him compassion. Heartbroken. When you told him about killing a loved one, he sympathized with your pain. Okay. Five percent. He was understanding of your hesitancy when you first met. When you allowed him to draw you, he generously gifted you with his drawing. How does that make him feel powerless? Okay. Brody dead. Mm. Again, I'm interested to see if that can have a different outcome. If you guys have played this game, let me know if there are any differences in your story. I'm really curious. I might even have to play this again when it's all done. I'll, I'll play it through properly first. But I was glad you checked on him for dinner. Ruby approved you teaching AJ manners. Mitch was happy to show off his weaponry skill. Asim was glad that you stopped AJ from reading his journal. Willie was fascinated by you. <laughs> Willie's a doofus. And he learned how to bond with Rosie. Okay, that's the state of the school. Ah. So there are two things that I missed. Another kind of skull and another kind of plant. Damn. It's weird that there are items. Kind of like the Wolf Among Us. It's kind of good in a way because it makes you want to explore everything. Alright, I guess that is it. Wow, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. That was a decent length as well. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with that. I think that was a good episode. It's definitely, I mean, I, I want to play the next one. <laughs> I want to know what happens. It sucks that you, we probably have to wait probably another one or two months to get the next one. But as soon as that comes out, I will be playing that, and I will see you then. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and yeah, take care.